What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, we're joining Bellhop Mike from Brawl Stars. Let's get started at the top of our page with the bottom edge of the hat. We start all the way over on the left side. We're gonna add a curve. We're gonna go up in the middle and then bend that back down on the right side. Now from the sides, we're gonna draw two straight lines going up along the top. Just line this up on the top and we'll connect the ends with that same curve. Going up and then bending that back down. Now the brim of the hat's gonna come down across the top of the forehead. So let's start over on the left side. Just gonna curve this down and then bend that back up on the right side. And then we'll layer the eyebrows on top of the eyes but in behind the hat brim. Let's start over on the left side, draw a straight angle line. Coming down and then in. Let's line this up on the right, going up and then out. Let's go back to the inside, curve the brow going up and then out underneath the hat brim. Let's go to the outside of the brow, draw a straight angle line coming in, angle that back out in behind the hat. Now we draw two circles for the eyes underneath the eyebrow. On the left side, we're going to step in, draw that circle, coming around towards the bottom of the eye, and just pull that up on the inside. Line this up on the right. And we'll pull the pupils towards the inside of the eye. Let's start from the very top. We're going to draw an oval. Coming down. And then back up. And we'll fill the pupils in black. Let's line up with the bottom edge of the eyes. Move to the center and draw on the nose. We're going to start over on the left. Curve down. And then up. And then on the ends, we're going to draw a short angle line going up and in. And then we'll move up and draw a short curve going up and then down for the bridge of the nose. Now we're going to draw the inside edge of the beard. Let's start from the outside corner of the nose, draw a straight angle line coming down and out underneath each eye. Angle up and out towards the side. And we'll draw a short angle line coming down and out. And we'll pull that straight up underneath the edge of the hat. Now we're going to move back and draw in the mouth. Let's start over on the left side. We're going to draw an angled line going up towards the right, to right about there. And we'll connect the ends with a curve. Bring down, round up the mouth, and then pull that back up. Let's draw a small half circle along the top, right in the middle of the teeth. Let's go down towards the bottom. Curve up and then out towards the right, and then we'll fill the inside of the mouth in black. Now I'm going to move to the side and draw the outside edge of the beard. From the bottom corner of the hat, draw a straight angle line coming down and then out. And then from here, draw a short angle line coming up and in. And I'll add two points on either side, starting on the left, angle down and then in. And we'll pull that up and in towards the center, just underneath the mouth. Let's move out to the side and draw on the ears. From the bottom corner of the hat, I'm just going to curve the ear going up down and then in towards the side. And now we're going to add some detail to the hat. Let's start by adding a thick trim along the bottom and the top. From the bottom corner we'll step up, just follow that same curve, going up and then down. Go up to the top, step down, and again just follow that same curve. Let's add that large metal plate in the center of the hat. From the top, we're going to step down. I'm just going to curve this out towards the left, round this out, and then come back in towards the middle. Now we're going to take that curve and flip it over on the right. So going back up to the top, go out towards the right, round this out, and then come back in. Let's draw two circles tucked in along the side. So we're going to start on the left, go around, and then in. 
and we'll add a small circle right in the middle. Let's draw that symbol in the center of the plate. We're gonna start right in the middle, start with a point, and go up and out toward the left and right side. And it'll flatten off the end, with a short line coming up and in. And pull this down and in, leaving a gap in the center. And from the inside, we're just gonna draw a short angle line going up and out. Close off the top with a straight line. Now we're gonna draw two ovals tucked in on either side. Let's start on the left. Coming down towards the bottom and then back up. Do the same thing on the right. And it'll fill that entire area in black. We're also going to add a button along the side of the hat. Let's start on the left. We'll draw a half circle. Going out and then in. Line this up on the right. And do the same thing. Now that we complete the head, let's move down and draw on the side of the body. From the bottom point of the beard, we're going to step out. Out and then down towards the hip. And the same thing on the right. And we'll connect the hips with a curve. Coming down and then up. And then we'll add two straight lines on either side of the body. Starting from the left, come straight down. Do the same thing on the right. And we'll add a thick trim on the outside. Stepping out, draw another line. Now we're gonna draw two circles along the top and the bottom. Let's start from that line, go all the way around, and back out, go to the right, do the same thing. And I'm gonna step down and do that again. and then we'll trace each of the circles along the inside. Now we're gonna continue working down towards the bottom of the feet. Let's go to the center, step down at a curve, left to right, going up and then down, and leaving a small gap in the middle, go to the left side, curve the leg going out and down towards the left heel, move over towards the right, go out, and down towards the same height. And then we'll round out the bottom of the feet. Starting from the left heel, curve the foot, coming down and then up on either side. And then we'll draw on the top of the foot. We'll start on the left side, curve up. I'm just gonna bend the foot coming down, aiming towards the heel. And then we'll round that out and go back up towards the inside of the leg. Let's move back up to the hips and draw the outside of the leg. Starting on the left, curve the leg going out, and then down on top of the feet. We're also gonna add a thick stripe along the side. Starting on the left, step in, just follow that same curve coming all the way down towards the bottom. Now we're gonna move back up and draw the arms holding two briefcases. Let's start halfway down the side of the body, starting right here, curve the arm going out, and then down towards the wrist. Line this up on the right. And do the same thing. And then from the wrist, we're gonna draw the thumb, drawing a half circle, coming in and then back out. Let's draw on the top of the handle, starting from the bottom of the thumb, we go up and then bend that down on the outside, just like drawing a half oval. And then from the outside, we're just gonna blend the hand going out, up, round out the arm, and then pull that in underneath the head. Let's go back in and draw on the handle. From the inside corner, draw two straight lines coming down on either side. And then we'll draw the top of the briefcase. We're gonna step out, just draw a straight line coming in. Let's come straight down along the sides. And then close off the bottom with a straight line. And then we'll trace the briefcases along the inside.
Let's go back up and draw on the cuff. We start from the top of the thumb, curve up, and then out on either side. Then we'll step up and draw that same curve coming in. And I'll add a trim along the bottom and top of the cuff. So we'll step up, and then just follow that same curve, and then do the same thing on the right side. Let's draw a button on the outside of the cuff. Starting from the top, curve out, and then bend that back in. Now we draw the luggage in behind the body. Let's start from the thumb, draw a straight line coming in towards the body. Line this up on the right. Now we step up and draw another line from the bottom of the trim. And I'll move to the top of the arm, go up, and bend that in underneath the head on both sides. And that's pretty much it. There's Bellhop Mike from Brawl Stars. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.